Alright, today I'm trying to look for a power block to charge batteries and stuff, and for some reason I don't have one out here, which I used to have like 20. But I cleaned this whole place minus like this corner the last two days, so I had room to do something in here. But I can't find a power block. But today's challenge is I want to mount the 360 camera somewhere on the bike so I can use it. And I don't want to put it right here on this mount, even though I could, but I don't want to. So I'm going to try to find a place to mount it so when I ride I can use it without holding it. So that's today's deal. Alright, so this is what I came up with. I just zip tied this selfie stick to the bike. It's pretty sturdy. So all the way out is there. It's pretty floppy, but it's sturdy over here. But that's kinda kinda sketchy, you know? I mean it'll only be for like a little cruise and like a wheelie or two, but camera falls off, camera falls off, I suppose. Or I could get even more sketchy with it and add the second stick. Yeah, I don't think we're gonna do that. I forgot that the float was sticking in my bike and it was overflowing, so I'm pulling it apart to clean it quick before I ride. And I get asked all the time what jets I run. Now that I can see, I'm running a 124 main jet with a 34 pilot jet on the 28 millimeter carb that comes with the 190. So that's what I'm running. I'm gonna gas her up quick, see if it doesn't leak out of the carb. Hopefully not. Okay, didn't even spill, wow. Well, it's not pouring out yet. That's good news. So I'm only gonna go on a short ride today. I got my Crocs on still. Probably won't do anything crazy though. Go out on the back road, maybe rip a wheelie. Make sure the selfie stick doesn't fly off. See if it runs good today. Look at that wrap. Ditchy camo. Oh, it feels good out in this wind though. It's hot today, like 90. It's like 90 today. So I got that camera out there. It's flopping all over the place. I just want to see if it'll even get any good. Good footage, probably not, maybe, who knows. But I'm gonna try to pull a wheelie with it. He's got a Harley sticker on his license plate, so we should show him what's up. Oh, diesel. Oh, cool. Smoke it out. Smoke it out, baby. Do cool diesel stuff while you're halfway on the road. Very cool. my way with your slow Harley ass. I'm gonna take this back home though. I got the Crocs on and stuff. I just wanted a quick little rip to make sure the carb was working right and stuff. Seems to be good. This guy just ruined my thing. I was gonna rip it and I got Fleming in my way. like that just a quick one through like three and then part of four 50 something miles an hour love that 
this is a quick little ride. I just want to make sure the carb was done leaking because I think, don't quote me, but I think we're going to get most of the group back together for Saturday and go on a little ride for the first time in like almost three years, I feel like, since I rode with basically anybody. Uh, we were going to do it this last weekend, but I was home with the kids and it was cruise night and it was just hectic outside. I wasn't about to take this out in that, in that chaos and get hit or something because people here drive like shit on a normal day. Cruise night's wild, no thanks. Didn't even take my car out, we just sat in the driveway and drank. But uh, yeah, we're gonna try to get a little cruise going Saturday with at least three of us, maybe more, but we're gonna try to get three of us. But real quick before I get home, max speed without me speed tucking at all, just sit straight up into the wind was 75.9 miles an hour. I rode 11 miles. Just a quick little blip out to my wheelie road and back. Nothing special, I got the Crocs on still. I'm not trying to go too crazy, it's so hot out. But yeah, I'm gonna call it a day there. 